everybody, Viewer London here. My name's Andrew. I'm Ingrid. And today we're going to be reviewing 11 fragrances from the perfume house Floreku. Before we get started, if you enjoy fragrance as much as we do, please subscribe to our channel. And we have a perfume giveaway once a month for one lucky subscriber to our blog's newsletter. It wins a nice bottle of perfume. Please check all that out on the show notes. So we did a bit of shopping online and <laughs> we have bought the Discovery set, which has got 11 of Floreku's most popular fragrances or best fragrances or whatever <laughs> fragrances so we're just going to be reviewing them all today for you kind of quite quickly um so we're not dragging you here for hours and hours um so ingrid first, first up, one first one is sleeping on the roof sleeping on a roof okay so let's give it a quick spray oh smell that already it's Ooh. very very fresh mm, that is very fresh, fresh and floral fragrance that's lovely it's light and airy mm -hmm. but it kind of it hits you with mm. this uh, lily of valley that's with nice a really really strong yeah i'll just scent. go through the perfume notes so the perfume notes are lily of the valley mm. orange blossom amber and musk um what, yeah, what do you think and you can you can oh, you can sense really nice. um like like you know that musky it is orangey as well I know. yes and, and orange but it's yeah. very Spring like mm. fragrance, really, it screams spring. Yeah, um, spring, when summer. Ev when everything blooms around mm -hmm. you, you know, yeah. that kind of fragrance. Really fresh, yeah, very that's, that's feminine. Very fresh. Very, very yeah, feminine. feminine. Lovely fragrance. Okay. Our next up is um, One Umbrella for Two. Nice, uh, nice um, um, name of that two. one, isn't let, it? Yeah. Let it give it a spray. Oh, it's oh, very, wow. very sweet wow. fragrance. Very, very aromatic. Mm. So that that is super very, black currant, isn't it? Very luxurious. Yeah. Just to quickly go through the notes, you've got black currant. I'm going to pronounce the next one wrong. Gen Macchia tea. I apologise to everybody that I can't say that. And cedar. Um, yeah, it's from uh, um, it's from Floreco. Oh, it's delicious. Teas and tea mm. and spice. Yeah, collection. it's like the tea ceremony. Oh. Oh wow, that is really, really nice and unusual. I haven't smelled anything like that. It's really nice because it begins with very, very sweet notes. Yeah. And now it, it smells like a biscuit to me. Yeah, it does. Yeah, biscuit like <laughs> it is. I don't it's think tea, that's what they were aiming for. Tea, tea and a biscuit. <laughs> tea, tea and biscuits. Lovely. Lovely fragrance. Wow, that is fantastic. But I love you, that. You can sense those spices that you have now and, and, and berries, obviously. Yeah. And it's very autumny fragrance, autumn, yeah, winter, winter. Um, day or night time. Mm -hmm. I think oh, wow. it would be That's perfect really nice. for both. Yeah. But it's really intense and mm. quite big. It is. Yeah, yeah, Quite yeah. big um, scent. It is. Um, yeah, and if you haven't got yourself a, um, a pack yet, get yourself one of these discovery sets because they're great value. Um, in the show notes, we'll pop a link and you can uh, get yourself one. Because we're quite keen to, uh, to enjoy all of them, aren't we, Ingrid? <laughs> yeah. So number three in the discovery set is the Moon and I. Another nice title. I like all their titles actually. I, I like all, the all names. their yeah, titles. Good. Yes, very clever. And really? just to be clear, Ingrid is washing her arm for every spray because otherwise <laughs> we'd be getting really confused. <laughs> <laughs> so this fragrance, it, it's got very strong Ooh, God, woody base. That is really tea. It, I don't know. It, yes, mm. but it is very very woody. And mm. the first, what you get is like. Very, very strong dark mm -hmm. tea. It is dark, yeah. So just to cut in, the, the notes is Mate's Absolute, which is like a, a bitter tea mm. uh, fragrance. Then we've got Matcha Tea. And then we've got Base Notes of Cedar. And it is very... It actually smelt to me like... And I haven't worked on the docks. But one, I imagine one of the crate boxes of tea made out of wood with the tea in it is, is kind of how that smelt. So uh, yes, it's it, lovely. It, it is very mm. masculine yes. fragrance really really bitter yeah and it, it would be it, all of the floreco fragrances are perfect for mm -hmm. layering and this is what they're designed for so it, it kind of you may feel that you might mm -hmm. need some you know floral yeah. or citrusy notes to be mixed in and you you, awesome. you, you you're free to to layer it with some other fragrances yeah. and make it your own but it, yes this is how it smells like well, i'm just going to cut in as well and just to say um if you ever open a brand new pack of tea when you've got the cellophane home you open it up this is what it smells, smells like smells a bit like that but in a good way <laughs> <laughs> so our number four in the set now yep. um is called i'm coming home i'm coming home <laughs> okay so let's try this spray this bad boy you got me again <laughs> okay that's fine give that a moment 
Oh, this is wonderful fragrance. Oh, that's nice. It needs to settle a bit. A... It's quite... Mm. That's really nice. It's very citrusy. It's not like citrusy. It's got a bit grapefruit. Well, yeah. Really I nice. mean, we just sprayed it, so we're going to get the top notes initially. Oh, but, my uh, goodness me. We'll let that, give that a minute to settle. Absolutely wonderful. So the notes fragrance. on this one is ginger, white tea, and cardamom oil. That's the three main notes that we've got there. So... Um, Given that, obviously, yes, it is I'm not going to give it ages to settle, but... And I was, I oh, would, yeah. That is I was really nice. It is a little citrusy. Yes, it is yeah, citrusy, it's not though. citrusy, because you have this zestiness. It does. It does. It does smell sense. zesty. Yes. Zesty like grapefruit, almost. Yes, but, it uh, does. Yeah. Not but you do get ginger from, from, from the nose. You do. And it's beautiful. It's really very, very yeah. aromatic. When to where, would you say? Um, autumn, spring. Okay, I'd fine. I'd say it's more... Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like, you know, mm. when you have this weather a bit fresh and a bit mm -hmm. warm, you yeah. know, kind of very mixture. Nice. That's a great fragrance. It's beautiful. Mm -hmm. And very long lasting as well, so. So number five on our uh, little discovery set yeah. is I See the Clouds Go By. I'm going to give that a spray, Ingrid. Give that a minute. It's quite looking forward to this one because it's got cherry blossom in. I'll read out the notes while we're waiting. We've got uh, Cacis, cherry blossom and musk. Oh, okay. You can get cherry blossom straight yeah, away. Yeah, yeah. This fragrance is based on Japanese culture. Mm -hmm. Okay. And it's really sophisticated. Mm -hmm. That's very not my favourite, though, I must say. I'll very just cut luxurious. in there. It keeps changing. Mm, it, it, is. It, it just keeps changing mm -hmm. now. You know, you've, yeah. you you got different notes at the beginning, and now mm. it, I'm kind not of, it settles down. I'm not a fan of that one, to be honest. It's got very interesting uh, What do you think? Are you, are you, do you enjoy that one? Would you wear it yourself? To me, um, it's a no, but I don't have to like everything. I'm not sure. I must yeah. say, I'm not sure. Maybe, mm -hmm. maybe it's not my. Okay, when to wear favorite. anyway? When, when would you wear it if you was going to wear it? Oh. Um, I think to me now personally, when I smell it, mm -hmm. I would say it would be summer fragrance. But the mm -hmm. reviews say mm, it's I'd more say it was winter. winter. Yeah, I yeah, would. Yeah. But, okay, that's interesting. So well, I would say it's like a, a, a summer fragrance to okay, me personally. To you. Yeah, exactly. That's and, and that's what fragrance it. is all about. So uh, if you're interested in smelling it yourself, get online, order yourself a box of this discovery set and you can have as much fun <laughs> as we are going for it all. So next up is Cricket Song, number six on our list. Uh, the notes are top notes of bergamot, mid notes of magnolia, and base notes of vetiver. So uh, we're going to spray me now. Let's buck <laughs> tradition, Ingrid. Give us a, give us a squirt. Oh, yeah, all right. Cool, blimey. <laughs> Let's give that a moment, shall we? Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, I can my tell God, that is lovely, isn't it? It is lovely. Oh, that is so good. That's really nice. It's sweet fragrance. Mm. It's got the freshness Ooh. in it. Yes, that's really nice. It's fresh. I mean, we need to let it settle, of course. Yes, we're just we doing do. a, We're doing a quick rush through here yeah. for you guys. But um, I think on initial, we'll just give it a minute. Um, but... That is uh, really nice. It's I, very spring-like totally uh, fragrance, yeah, I would spring, say. Spring, summer, and more, I would say, in, yeah. and more like daytime fragrance. Mm. That's nice. I'm not getting much bergamot on there, to be honest. Um, it is magnolia. Am, it's totally magnolia. I am getting bergamot. And it, Are you? It, yeah, I do get the, the, the mm. citrusy notes. Yeah, you know. okay. But if you enjoy magnolia, I think you'd know about it. Um, mm. And if you like vetiver as well, it, I mean. It, it does, mm. to me, it, it needs layering with mm -hmm. some... A bit sweeter fragrances, mm -hmm. maybe. Yeah, for you. Okay, maybe a yeah. bit of musky base I would want in it. Yeah. A bit more heaviness to it mm -hmm. as well. Yeah, um, for me this is more more evening fragrance, me as a guy, but you know, everyone's different. So yeah, you're so not a lover or you're a lover, what um, do you think? I'm not lover like as much. Okay, that's fine. But you I don't like love it. it. I, I like fragrance. I really like it. So, I, I yeah. like the scent, mm -hmm. but I wouldn't pick it for myself. Okay, fair so. enough. Number seven um, on our list. On our list, in our um, box. Yes, it's cool. First dream of the year. First dream Sorry of the year. Sorry to read it from the bottle. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay, Ingrid, it, let's go. Uh, hit me with it. Oi, okay. Oh. Go on, blimey. That's fine. <laughs> it's a bit too much. Right, let's give that a second. Mm, this is fresh. Yes, okay. So the, uh, the, the, the notes, as they say, is um, top notes of grapefruit, mid notes of orange blossom, and base notes of iris. It's very, very orangey. It's very yeah. citrusy, it's actually. It's citrus floral, it's not like orangey, obviously. Yes. So what all you mm. get is grapefruit and orange. Yeah, I can just see I... oranges at the moment. And nothing else. I can't get mm. anything else. No, 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 but it's not if, meant to if be. If I'm completely uh, honest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But there isn't anything else there. Um, I, I think well, it's um, now spring, Well, settle down a little bit summer. more. Yes, it would be spring, summer. Mm. That's but nice. I need 
it's layered. Yes, I think you do because I, I do don't need think there's much. With, there's no base there. You don't have any like patchouli or vetiver or no. amber or musk. No. Um, but then again, that's, that, look, they're going for this. the whole point is having something a bit different. But you may be happy to wear yeah, it yeah. on its own, you know, depending nice. depending if you yeah, if you yeah. like it or not. Mm. But to me, it, it just needs a bit yeah. more sweetness to it. I'd wear it though. It's an interesting fragrance. I think it's nice. Number eight is my shadow on the wall. My shadow well, on the wall. It's not my shadow okay. on the wall. Someone's shadow. <laughs> Someone's shadow on the wall. I uh, will give it a spray. Just please. So the notes on this one is violet leaf on the top. Uh, we've got mid notes of mimosa mm -hmm. and we've got base notes of sandalwood. You're happy already, <laughs> clearly. Oh, that's oh, right up my street. That is really good though, isn't it? It is my beautiful. Eye? That's fantastic. It's got the right amount of like spice. like that one. Yes. It's okay. got the right amount of sweetness. You've got to check out my shadow on the wall. You need to check this out. Oh. That's really good, isn't it? Yeah. I mean, it's, this is initial, you know, re it is review. Initial reaction. You know, we, we need to, yeah, initial reaction. We need to let it settle, but. Uh, if I can say it's really aromatic, spicy, mm. floral, sexy fragrance, mm -hmm. if you want to pick yourself a nice yeah. fragrance for that. That's fantastic. Special date Love it. night. Yeah, special date night. Do choose this one. Yeah, that's good. It's it okay. beautiful. My Shadow on the Wall, I think that's almost one of our favourites. And it's, it's, it's really winter fragrance, yeah. but to me, I would probably wear no, it all year round because yeah, I love this kind of fragrance. So, number nine uh, in the box on our list is my favourite sounding one, Sound of a Ricochet. Sounds good. <clears throat> do you want to uh, give that a spray ingredient? You can, come on, you can hit me with it. Thank you. Yeah. Let's give that a moment. It's another spicy, aromatic Ooh, fragrance. That's good. Which it's is... got vanilla in it. Okay, oh, sorry. Yeah. I've got to better go through the notes. We've got notes of vanilla, tonka bean, and sandalwood. So although we've kind of listed vanilla as a top, yeah. I think they're all they're all bases, they isn't it? They are all bases. Oh, it's very woody that's really fragrance. Good, isn't it? Yeah, that's and I say really very nice. woody. It needs to settle the, a bit, but the first hint of the waff of um, scent. Um, I got it was more floral, yeah. and now I'm getting all the wood. Mm. So it's all woody. Yeah, that is really woody, isn't it? Yeah, it's, it's very woody. Yeah, but it's creamy as well. I don't know if you can get the creamy vanilla yes, in there. Yes, it is balsamic. You know, mm. balsamic. Okay, I love um, anything with vanilla, but, so that's fantastic. Yes, it's very, very wintry, autumny yeah. fragrance. Okay, sound um, of a ricochet, another great buy, I think, out of that collection. It is. Um, that really Maybe stands it's up. more masculine than feminine, although it's a unisex yeah, fragrance. Yeah. But no, no. Yes. Yeah, I, I think on you as well. I think that's, I, I, that's, I equally, love it. that's equally good. Yes, I yeah. love it. Yeah, it's really nice. So next up on our list, yep. which is number 10, and it's called My Love Has the Color of the Night. Do, oh, fair enough. Okay. <laughs> give yourself a spray, Ingrid. I will give myself a spray. Ooh. I'm spraying all over me. So notes-wise, and I do it just to trip me up with my accent, uh, I think it's Guake Wood. I'm crucifying the name of that, but um, I'll put it in the show notes. Uh, patchouli. Oh, and Vetiver. That's oh, you're very, it, very yeah. nice. It's very masculine oh. fragrance. It's really masculine. Is it? I don't, mm, I like I don't it. think I would oh. risk wearing it, although I absolutely love it. You could layer that with something else that's more can... floral sweet up front, yes, maybe. You, you but can layer with some... On its own, maybe slightly masculine. Um, oh, smells like evergreen trees to me. That's fantastic. You know? That's nice. Like evergreen yeah, trees. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's woody. Like freshly cut. <laughs> it, freshly sawed down. It, it reminds me of like, those snowy winters, mm. you know, full of snow. Like, yeah. Really, well, for you then, obviously, really a cold. winter, autumn winter yes, fragrance. It would be winter. Yeah. It's very nice. Yeah. Uh, that hit gets on my hit list I as well. I think it's more winter than autumn, to be oh, honest. Oh, yeah. I, I, think I it's totally, more like cold, cold, totally wear that. Cold. Yeah. Nice. Okay. Another great fragrance. So, number 11 <laughs> on our list is Between Two Trees, final one, Ingrid. Give us a hit with that. I'll read out the, the notes. We've got top notes of grapefruit, mid notes of mate absolute, which is like bitter tea. We've got base notes of vetiver as well. We smoke you woody kind of, mm -hmm. kind of effect. Have you sprayed it yet? Yes, I have. Oh, yeah. Wow, yeah, okay, I've got that. It's, it's really intense fragrance. That is, yeah. It, yeah, it's, it's nice. It's like crazy that. intense. Yes, yeah, because it's very it masculine. Yeah, it's bitter. Yeah, it's masculine. It's very masculine. Very masculine. It's nowhere near feminine. No. Although they say it's unisex, I totally disagree. It smells of a man just having okay. had a cigarette. He's had a cigarette. Okay. <laughs> it, it, it's, it's, it's how it smells. 
Very elegant man, don't get me wrong. Uh, oh, oh, okay, elegant, elegant man. man. Not like a hobo smartly, or a tramp. Smartly dressed and, you know, smelling yeah, okay. with nice fragrance. But mm-hmm. it's all mixed with... But, but he's, with had a, he's had a cheeky smoke. cigarette as well. <laughs> okay. So, <laughs> okay, so that rounds this up really nicely with that picture. But no, absolutely, Ingrid, you've got to say what you feel. So with that, not a winner for you. I think it's really nice, um, but it is a guy fragrance. Yes, it is. It I is. probably wouldn't wear that one myself, so... I don't think we'd really recommend I wouldn't uh, want you this to particular wear it. one. No? Okay, fair enough. Okay. So, so that rounds it up for our most popular uh, Floreco fragrances from their Discovery set. Certainly worth buying yourself um, yes, it is. a Discovery set. Um, links in the show notes if you're interested to find out where the heck to get that from. And yeah, thoroughly recommend it as a bit of a fun experience of going through everything <laughs> they've got on offer. Discovery set um, is Between Two Trees. Ingrid, do you want to give yourself a quick spray? I'll quickly list off the notes. Sorry, we've got a fly <laughs> trying to attack us. Do you know what? I'm not even going to cut that. We'll keep rolling. Um, we've got top, no- top notes. <laughs> I will cut that. <laughs> That's cut a blooper. Spray.